We're about to put the pedal to the metal and bring to life a monowheel that was meant to replace the tried and true bicycle. The patent that's got the wheels turning in our heads is something a little less stable than the good old fashioned two-wheeler. American inventor Vernon Venerable patented his own design in 1897 for a vehicle that was essentially its own wheel. To start things off, we take a look at an old example of a monowheel. Almost immediately, we discover one of the monowheel's biggest problems, the dreaded gerbil effect. <laughs> the gerbiling effect effect is a big problem because if you actually get this thing rolling and if you want to stop then you're just going to keep sliding around with it. I think that could be very dangerous. This initial test proves that without safety handles and spotters serious injuries are a real possibility. Jer is totally under the impression that I built this thing to help him develop his 1897 monowheel but my matter wheel is going to continue to evolve and become deadly fast and in the end, I'm gonna race him, and I'm gonna kick his butt. Once our monowheel's finished, we're off to the racetrack for its initial spin. I am definitely pumped about our monowheel, because other than some minor changes, like the handlebars and spotters for safety, we've really stayed true to Vernon Venerable's original design. It's obvious from the get-go that this ride is different from anything Matt has experienced up till now. According to our calculations, Matt's energy expenditure to power the monowheel is 720 calories per hour. Devastatingly inefficient compared to the two-wheel bikes of the same era, which burn between 3 and 500 calories per hour. A person would be exhausted before they reach the corner. This day ain't over yet. Jeremy's going to race the reinvented monowheel against me driving the inspirational model. Even if our monowheel isn't practical, we'd like to know if it's at least an improvement. It's time for the final showdown. Ready, set. With the finish line in sight, we each give one final push for the glory. Unfortunately for me, there's only one trophy handed out on this particular race day. Oh! Did you just get kissed? <laughs> I want kisses!